Soil survey application and here we go. So the first thing we want to do is we want to type in an address. So those of you that are in Yuma, you can either click on Arizona and you can start zooming in and you can find the place that's closest to you or you can type in the address. Okay, I happen to know the address for Yuma for the Agricultural Experiment Station there is 6425 West 8th Street and that's in Yuma, Arizona and the zip there is 85364 okay so we're going to take a view of that now that'll save us a little bit of time and here we are at the Yuma Agricultural Experiment Station and we can zoom in as far as we want to okay but let me first of all identify the area that you're going to want to take your sample of okay and I'm showing it to you right here it's this field right here this field is on the south east corner of the intersection of Somerton and 8th Street okay so you're gonna use that field there so I'm gonna use this field right here but you remember this is the field I want you to identify I'm gonna do this one right here so I'm gonna first of all just zoom in on this and see what kind of close-up we can get this might be pretty good okay now that I've got it I want to identify an area of interest and this is kinda of rectangular so I'm gonna use this particular feature right here it says area of interest we're gonna outline it there assuming we've got a big enough sample it should come back and it should give us some uh, characteristics okay you see we've got the layers in there now and so this is done so we could print a picture of this if we want to now I want you to go up to the soil map and I want you to click on the soil map and then I want you to I did look at that we've got two different soils in this so if I was going to ask you to do this you'd tell me we've got two different soils here so we've got a Holtville clay and we got a uh, it looks like a K of A clay but of course uh, that's a Kofa clay so since we've got more of the Holtville clay I'm gonna ask I'm gonna go ahead and click on that one so that's number 12 down here and you can see this is Yuma Welton area parts of Yuma County tells us the elevation it tells us different things what we want to do down here is that we want to look and see that the capacity the most limiting layer to transmit water moderately low to moderately high okay and in uh, what we really want to know is this typical soil profile down here so from 0 to 13 inches is clay from 13 to 23 inches is clay so if you were going to answer if this was the field in question what you would do is that you would tell me that this is a uh, a Holtville clay and that the 0 to 13 inches is clay and 13 to 23 inches is clay okay and that's all you'd have to do the uh, idea is just to be able to use this as a tool that'll be fine okay now uh, for those of you that are in Tucson I'm going to show you another example here so we're going to go back to the home page here there we go this is what I want to do okay so I want to put in the campus ag center address which is 4101 North Campbell Ave Avenue and that's in Tucson and the zip there is 85719 Okay, now we're going to view that. Alright, here we go. We found it. So this is the uh, Campus Ag Center here. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to identify an area here that's a little bit, so we can kind of zoom in on it a bit. There we go. Okay, so for those of you that are in Tucson, I want you to do this field right here see north uh, yeah, that's going to be the north west corner of Campbell and Roger 
We've got the northwest corner. We want that field right there. I don't know what they have planted in there right now. I think it's maybe grapes. But I'm going to pull up another field for you here just for fun. And I know that we have an interesting crop planted right over here in these fields here. So I want to see what kind of soil we have in there. Okay, and I'm going to again select an area of interest. I'm going to identify that field. Alright, so I've got it identified now. I'm going to uh, go to the soil map up here. Click on soil map. And look, I've got a Glendale Silt Loam, 0 to 3 percent. So I'm going to click on that. And it tells me I've got a Glendale Silt Loam, and it come down here to the uh, properties and uh, capacity the most limiting layer to transmit water, moderate high to high. And it tells me the rate. And if the typical profile down here is 0 to 4 inches is silt loam, and 4 to 60 inches is clay loam. So that's how you would answer question number 14 and be able to identify this there. Of course, this is not the field you're going to use. You're going to use that one on the corner, which would be the northwest corner of Campbell and Roger. I hope that helps you utilize the, uh, the soil conservation survey map and uh, makes that uh, a very easy tool to use.